Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Storytime with Miss Debbie. Today I chose the story, Fly, Baby Bird, Fly. I chose this story because this month we were talking about transportation. We know that birds cannot take the train or the bus or the car. They fly to get around, so that is their form of transportation. And they also have tiny little legs that they do walk around with, which we all know walking is also a form of transportation. Let's go over really quick. The person that writes the words of the story is called the author. The author of this book is Susan Frame. The illustrator is the person who draws the pictures in the story. The illustrator is Jim Story. Let's go in the book and see what it's about. Fly, baby bird, fly. Here's the baby bird in the nest. Go, said the mother bird. Go, go, go. No, said the baby bird. No, no, no. So the mommy bird was telling the baby bird to go. She wanted the baby to fly. But the baby bird said, no, no, no. I don't think the baby bird was ready to fly. Why, said the father bird. Why, why, why? I can't fly, said the baby bird. That's why. So the father bird wanted to know why the baby bird did not want to go flying. So the baby bird said, I don't know how to fly because it was just a baby. When you guys were little, you had to learn how to walk. He has to learn how to fly. Jump, said the mother. One, two, three. Flap, said the father. Flap, flap, flap. So the mommy wanted the baby bird to jump, so she counted one, two, three. And the father bird wanted the baby bird to flap its wings. We know that their arms are called wings, and they're able to fly when they flap them. Whee! said the baby bird. I can fly! I can fly! Goodbye! Goodbye. So at the end, the baby bird was so excited because the baby bird was able to fly because the mommy and the daddy helped him. Miss Debbie will post the, up the words in the story so you can learn them. The end. Bye.